the ability to take humans to new frontiers of the universe, SpaceX's Starship is considered one of the hottest spots attracting global attention. This is not surprising as SpaceX has previously achieved a historic milestone with the Falcon 9 rocket, which Elon Musk dubbed as SpaceX's workhorse. The success of Falcon 9 has captured the world's attention and brought awareness to the breakthroughs in space technology that the company is achieving. So what did SpaceX do with Falcon 9 in order to shock the world? Let's find out in today's episode of Great SpaceX. After 20 years of formation and development, SpaceX is still a name that continuously breaks its own records. SpaceX's Falcon 9 rocket was launched in June of 2010, 12 and a half years ago. The Falcon 9 rocket is 70 meters tall and has a mass of 1.2 million pounds. Its first stage is powered by nine Merlin engines that generate 1.3 million pounds of thrust at sea level, which increases to 1.5 million pounds after the rocket reaches the vacuum of space. Falcon 9 can carry payloads of up to 22,800 kilograms to low Earth orbit, or LEO, and payloads of up to 8,300 kilograms to geostationary transfer orbit. Considering that the company's only previous experience was with a very unreliable, low-intensity rocket, the Falcon 9 had an impressive start, failing only partially in its first five years of operation. Then came the boom period of Falcon 9 with a series of new records being set. Since launch, a series of Falcon 9 rockets have been launched 222 times over 13 years, resulting in 219 fully successful missions and one partially successful mission. The success rate of 99.1% is one of the golden ratios in the rocket industry. In 2022, Musk was extremely ambitious with a goal of 60 Falcon 9 launches, which makes SpaceX nearly double its previous annual launch record. For the first time in its history, SpaceX not only met, but exceeded the predictions of its operators. The Falcon 9 set a new record with 60 launches with 100% success. They used the same legal and convenient method and launched within a calendar year. Falcon 9 set a record that beat the previous record held by the Soviet Union for four decades for the most rocket launches in a year of 47 total launches, with 45 being successes in 1979. Not only that, Elon Musk went on to announce a huge goal of 100 launches by 2023, which is crazy, but if this were to happen, on average, SpaceX will launch two rockets per week, and not only has it had a number of launches, Falcon 9 is also famous for achieving the record for the shortest launch time between two rockets. In 2022, SpaceX was constantly making improvements to Falcon 9, and that effort has clearly been demonstrated. In February, SpaceX successfully launched its third Falcon 9 rocket in less than 72 hours, breaking the record for payload fare reuse and putting the 2000th operational Starlink satellite into orbit. Just four months later, SpaceX continued to have the time to launch three rockets rockets to 36 hours. Congratulations to the SpaceX Falcon team for making three perfect launches in two days, CEO and founder Elon Musk shared in a tweet. SpaceX's successful completion of three launches in 36 hours is just an extension of that feat, because by the end of 2022, SpaceX achieved more than that. The time was really tense. The two rockets were scheduled only a few minutes apart, and all three launches were within about 11 hours of each other. But the careful sequence that SpaceX settled on ultimately produced impressive results and allowed the company to break its own world record for the fastest time to complete three launches of the same rocket. SpaceX was only two hours short of its own feat when it successfully launched an Earth observation satellite, a pair of commercial communication satellites, and 54 Starlink satellites in less than 34 hours. This marks the company's continued push towards ever higher launch frequencies. SpaceX was on track to do rocket launches that work like an airplane. This means that the distance between SpaceX and part of the world is getting closer and closer. In addition, by launching three Falcon 9s in a row in 34 hours, it has also made history by doing so whenever there is active development in space. SpaceX has completed two Falcon 9 launches with the Crew Dragon mission to the ISS and deployed 52 additional Starlink satellites to the more than 3,000 active satellite constellation. 
Completing two Falcon 9 launches in over 7 hours almost halved SpaceX's previous record of 14 hours and 8 minutes set by a pair of launches in June of 2022. It also proves that the company can continuously prepare and complete many Falcon 9 launches very fast. This is a positive signal to realize CEO Elon Musk's unprecedented goal of up to 100 launches by 2023. Less than 24 hours later, a third rocket carrying the Galaxy 33-34 communications satellite was launched. They had three Falcon 9s launched in 31 hours. SpaceX once again broke its own record of launching three rockets and just set a record for all rockets in the world. But to maintain their performance, SpaceX continues to optimize their time to launch two Falcon 9s, having achieved a groundbreaking time of four hours apart in early 2023. Impressive, a world record unmatched by previous rockets, starting with the launch of 52 Starlink internet satellites from California and ending with the launch of two payloads containing SES satellites at sunset from Florida this consecutive launch has helped SpaceX continue to strengthen its position as one of the leading companies in the field of space development and operation. It's become increasingly common for a company to have beaten its competitors so thoroughly that, by many measures, it has become unrivaled. Now, only former Soviet records and a retired NASA rocket can surpass SpaceX, a company more than 20 years old. Well done, SpaceX. But is there anything that can beat SpaceX? The answer is definitely no. At least, not yet. Around the world, companies and countries are struggling to compete. While SpaceX is famous in the aerospace world, its competitors are swimming in a quagmire. They are beaten by Falcon 9's long achievements. Even United Launch Alliance is phasing out its Atlas and Delta rockets in favor of more competitive Vulcan boosters. Let's talk about the Vulcan for a bit. Built for nine years, it's finally scheduled to fly on May 4th. However, the Vulcan doesn't seem to be on par with the Falcon 9 when it comes to testing problems with imaging. An explosion recently happened at the Marshall Space Flight Center. Tori Bruno, the chief executive officer of United Launch Alliance, also acknowledged the incident on Twitter. But one thing is for sure. Vulcan's launch schedule is long delayed, and catching up with Falcon 9 is unlikely. Meanwhile, another rival company, Blue Origin, and its new Shepard has only launched 22 times since 2015, and no payloads have reached orbit, a figure that is only a third of the number of rockets launched by Falcon 9 last year. The launch period is usually one to two months, while the Falcon 9 has launched more than 10 times in that period. It has become a gap too vast for new Shepard. Even the Big Brother rocket, New Glenn, after eight years of production, was expected to launch back in 2020, but it was also delayed up and down until the fourth quarter in 2023. But the most arguably dynamic competitor for SpaceX would have to be China. They are eager to reach a record of 200 rockets by 2023, but so far they are still one step behind SpaceX with 18 launches, while SpaceX has launched 22 rockets since the beginning of the year. Although China is working to speed up rocket launches, SpaceX is emerging as a strong competitor with its advanced technology and ability to continuously develop. It is clear that SpaceX's Falcon 9 is still maintaining its launch cadence, but it is not certain that China can surpass it. It can be said then that SpaceX is the lion that has dominated space travel for the past 21 years, having a fairly rough start, and Falcon 9 has broken the records of previous rockets as well as its own and is continually setting the bar creating many new steps for the goals and future plans of SpaceX, and at the same time, opening a new door for space lovers around the world. And that's about it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoy what my team and I are doing, you can become a patron through our Patreon link in the description below. Otherwise, as always, this is Kevin from Great SpaceX, and my team and I will see you next time.